Good morning, how to set up HTTP2 with server push functionality on your Express.js server. Usually when you load the web page, the browser first loads the HTML document, then it parses it, checks what assets does it need to load next, and then makes a bunch of requests. So in our case, the browser saw that we have an image and we have two JavaScript files. So after loading the HTML page, it made three additional requests to load those assets. With HTTP2, we now have the push functionality. So if the server knows that the browser will need certain assets, it can push them along with the original HTML document. Now let's create our HTTP2 capable web application. First, I create a new folder, make dir HTTP2 example. I go to this folder, HTTP2 example, and initialize a new node application, npm init y. Now I need to install the dependencies, yarn add express spdy. HTTP2 requires you to serve the assets through HTTPS, so we'll need to create the certificates. Here is the command, don't worry, I will leave it in the description. Country code se, and I will leave every other field empty. Now let's open the editor. First, I'm gonna create the public folder, new folder, public. Inside of it, I will create another folder called JS and a bunch of files there, foo.js and file called bar.js. Inside the foo.js, I will log console, log the script foo was loaded. And in the bar.js, I will say the script, oh, the script bar was loaded. I will create a folder for images as well. New folder, images, and then I will copy some image that I have to this folder. cp, anisdomi, public, images, enter. And I will rename the image to image.png. Now let's create the HTML file, new file index.html inside of it html colon 5 and it will create the layout automatically let's rename the title http2 rocks and inside of the body element let's draw the image src equals images image png and don't forget the dot in the beginning and now let's define two scripts. Script src equals js foo js. And same for the bar js. Let's specify the alt for our image. Alt equals cat meme. Now let's create our server. New file index.js. First require a spdy, speedy, that will allow us to serve HTTP2. Const spdy equals require spdy then we need to import express const express equals require express then we'll need the file system to load our files const fs equals require fs and we'll need the promiseify from utils to make it easier to work with the file system module const promiseify equals require util now let's create the promise version of read file, const read file equals promiseify fs read file. Now let's create the express application, const app equals express call. Let's define the static folder for our static assets, app use express static and it's public because we put our assets into the public folder. Now let's define the root URL. App, get, root URL, and then the callback. Request, response, the callback body. This callback will be async because we are gonna load the index.html asynchronously. Try, in case of catch error, we reply with status 500, which means something is broken, and we send, error to string. Now inside of the try block, we write 
the response code 200, everything is fine, and we write our index.html file. res.and await read file index.html. Now we'll use spdy to create our server. spdy create server. We need to pass the key and the certificate that we created earlier. We pass an object with the fields key, fs read file sync. We use read file sync here because without the key and certificate loaded, our application doesn't make any sense. So we shouldn't even launch it. So we use read file sync, server key, and certificate server.crt. We pass the express app as a second argument. Then we call the spdy server method listen on port 8000. We pass a callback that in case of an error, we'll throw it and otherwise it will log that server is listening on port 8000. Let's launch our application. Make sure to open localhost with HTTPS because we are now serving the HTTPS because we want to work with HTTP2 and it's required to use HTTPS. So HTTPS localhost 8000, you will be presented with this connection is not private. Proceed to localhost. And here you go. All our assets are served now through HTTP2, but they're not pushed yet. So let's add the server push, and we're gonna push the image and two script files. Go back to index.js, and inside of our get root URL try block, add an if. We're gonna check if the browser supports push. If res push, then we will go through a list of our assets, and it is JS foo.js, js bar.js, images, image.png, and we go through each of those names for each async file. We press push, we push the file name with the data that we get by loading using the read file from the public folder with the file name. Let's relaunch the app. Now reload the page. Now inside of the network tab, in the initiator column, you will see that the bar.js, foo.js and image.png are being pushed for the index file. Thank you for watching this video. If you have questions, leave them in the comments. And also I have a Discord server that you can join to propose new topics for the next videos. And see you next time.